So Archangel Gabrielle is the angel that associated with the water element. This is the angel that when you are seeking fertility, you're seeking um, birth, you're seeking um, family problems. Um, this is the angel that you would be corresponding with because this is the angel that is the ruling angel um, for to seek out when you're you know you have any kind of fertility issues um, now when you're doing an invocation I just want to let you know you are using four archangels when you are literally opening up the pentagram right so when I talked in my previous videos when you're corresponding using the pentagram to speak to God you would use Archangel Michael, Archangel Gabriel, Archangel Raphael, and you'll use Uriel. Now, Uriel is not an Archangel, but you can contact Uriel as well. And Uriel is um, the angel that connects to the north, right, when you're doing the pentagram. And the element is earth, right? So just like Gabriel element is water, um, Michael element will be fire and Raphael element will be air okay so these are the these are the four archangels when you are connecting to um, to the creator this is who you're going to be using um, before you the right of you behind you the left of you okay so these archangel names are very important to understand the elements um, and understand how to connect to them right now if you are now, Gabriel is ruled in the first heaven out of the nine spheres. So, Gabriel is connected to Yisar, the sphere um, connected. Now, I didn't speak about the tree of life, and I didn't speak about the spheres, but when, we, when we're talking about the heavens, we're talking about the spheres, the surface, and there's nine, right? And it connects you back to um, this planet that associated with the spheres. Now, that doesn't mean that the planets are the heavens. That doesn't mean that. They are connecting to the tree of life. The planets also connect to the tree of life. So the moon is the planet. The heaven that associates with the planet is Yisat. So in previous videos, I talk about planetary angels, like intelligence, um, different uh, spirit, which is angels that is in... A previous video that I have made um, and I'll go more in depth with that because you understand that these things are so it's so much things to learn and understand but as you are on your spiritual journey and learning you will have to get the bits and pieces and then kind of just put everything into prospect and into like the information that I'm saying and then you'll be able to understand how things operate and flow on the realm so we're, we're talking about planets and we're talking about the sphere of the tree of life which is in the heavens okay so Yisad is the heaven and that is the first heaven and Gabriel actually sits Archangel Gabriel sits in the first heaven and this is the angel that you will correspond with and connect to for fertility issues okay now Raphael is ruling the second heaven and Raphael is in the eighth sphere of the tree of life. And it's connected to Mercury. And that sphere is called Hod, right, in the tree of life. Okay? And Raphael is the archangel that heals. Now, when you want to connect to the archangel, you will be using um, Raphael, which is in the air element. When you're connecting to the archangel for healing. And this is this angel actually rules on Wednesday, right? Just like Gabriel rules on Monday, and it's the same times in the angel times. It's it starts from 1 a.m., 8 a.m., 3 p.m., and then 10 p.m. Okay. So I'm gonna continue going. Haniel is the ruling angel of love. And that angel sits in the seventh sphere of the tree of life. And it's connected to the planet Venus. And in the tree of life, that heaven is called Net Netzach. And it's in the... 
Now, as we continue, we're going to go into Archangel Michael. Now, Archangel Michael is a fighting angel. This is the Archangel Michael that is going to connect you to fame and fortune. This, this is the Archangel that actually... Um, is a fire elemental archangel he's connected to the fire elements um he sits in the heaven that's called tifet he's the the sun is connected to um tifret in the tree of life but it's but tifret is the heaven the sun is the planets right so it's on the planetary side which is the sun so we talked about again we talked about planetary angels and we talked about archangels. Archangels are connected to the tree of life. They are connected to the heavens. Now, there's planetary angels that you could connect to. But these are the high heavenly host beings, right? And when you're connecting to the archangels, you could connect to the archangels through a six-pointed star. You could connect to the archangels through um, a five-pointed star, right? Now, the six-pointed star, we talked about the macro and we talked about the five-pointed star, which we talked about the um, micro, right? And when you're doing the pentagram, you're going to realize you're constantly always using the archangels for the micro, which is the five-pointed star. Although you can't contact um, the archangels through the six-pointed star, but because it's the macro, you will more go to the heavenly beings um, as you're going through to God with the six-pointed star and versus you're going through the archangels with the five-pointed star. So keep keep in mind when you are using the element pentagrams and you're using the element, you will be connecting through the archangels through that way. Um, Michael rules the fourth heaven. Um... Michael and Raphael are both solar angels. They sometimes exchange the rulership of the sun and Tifret. Now, you may say to yourself, well, how come it's planetary angels, but also Archangel Michael is ruling? Because the heavens governs over the planet. So keep, keep in mind, although the heavens govern over our earth, the heavens also govern over the planets as well with the planetary beings that sit in those planets and the planetary angels. They are they are not on the same level of the archangels. The archangels are higher than the planetary beings and the planetary angels. Keep that in the back of your mind. So these are very high celestial beings, which is archangels. Now we move to the fifth heaven, which this heaven is ruled by Kamel. And in the fifth Spear in the tree of life, it is connected to Gerba, which is the planetary is connected to Mars. So, this is an angel that is you will use this angel because this is a arc, this is an archangel that is a fighting archangel, and you can use this angel to connect for your enemies, for judgment, for prison, for um, illness. Because you're using these things to fight against um, things that's coming your way, right? So, so the reason I'm specifying enemies, judgment, illness, you can use, you could contact Kamel to kill a disease, to, to remove an enemy, to, um, to stop jail time, right? So you're, you're, you're basically ending whatever is in your life that's causing you harm. And again, specifying the angel times 1 a.m., 8 a.m., 3 p.m., 10 p.m., um, and these are the times that they actually rule, right? So this, this archangel is ruling on Tuesday. So let's continue with Zadikel. Now, I told you about Zadikel when I was actually starting my career and I wanted to actually get into a career, not a job. I used to contact Zadikel every Thursday. Every Thursday at 10 a.m. PM. Now you don't need to contact them for the four times that they're four times that you have connection. You have immediate soulless connection on the time frame. So from 1 a.m., 8 a.m., 3 p.m., and 10 p.m., any one of those four time frames, you can start doing some connection. You you want to connect through um, 
they're different styles of connection and I'll actually explain to you how to make sure you connect the right way. Now, Zadikel is ruled in the sixth heaven, which is in the tree of life. And in that heaven is called chess. And it's the connection of the planet is in Jupiter. Now, everybody, I don't know if you guys are aware, when you're, when you're going through planetary angels, Jupiter is your money. It's basically an expansion. This is how you get money. Now, somebody who is into the zodiac signs, and they're going to understand that when Jupiter goes into your planet, like line up with your um, sun sign, right? Your birth chart, in your birth sign, that is where you will have opportunity to actually gain more success. So Jupiter is always an expansion. This is always always a time when your money will just come in right. Now Zadikel is ruled on Thursday. Now if you go through planetary, you're going to understand that on Thursday, that's your money day. That's the day that you are able to access money. Now let's continue going because we're now at the sixth heaven. So now we're going into the seventh heaven. And... The seven heaven is ruled by Bina, which is the planet connected to Saturn. And that archangel is called Cassiel. Now, this is the angel that you will be able to gain property. You will be able to purchase. You will be able to, um, you know, when it comes down to anything that that comes underneath assets, this is the angel that you'll be accident. And this angel is ruled on Saturday. So keep that in mind. This archangel rules on Saturday. Now, when I'm going to refer to the seven heavens that's ruling the earth, and I will also refer to their seven planets that has governs over the earth. So keep in mind that I only went up to seven heavens based on, and it's actually more, more levels of the heavens. As we go on and we learn about the archangels and we learn about other angels as you continue to watch this channel and how you can make access to the angels and how you can actually change your life in the most positive, high vibrational way, the most positive ways that you can actually raise your vibration up, connect to your higher self and literally change everything about your life because when we talk about connecting to the angels as you use these archangels name you will understand that there's a frequency on these archangels so we're going to go into another video and in that video we're going to specify and talk a little bit more about how we can actually communicate with these archangels and who are the archangels and um how to actually communicate with them now for instance when you communicate with haniel haniel is the angel of love and haniel is not an angel that where you are uh, corresponding with haniel and you're zombieizing somebody or you're doing some kind of ritual on a person to get them to fall madly in love with you haniel will only work with you unless you already have that relationship and that person is already in love with you and now you can actually ask haniel for that person to open up that person's eyes for them to see you in a light for them to see who you are and understand who you are and have you know to increase your love so that's where you're using haniel because haniel will not the angels don't interfere with our lives in the way that we will want them to be um if it doesn't serve you purpose you would not get assistance okay so keep that in mind now uriel is not an archangel uriel is a solar angel and that angel is also um connected to the sun um underneath the planetary part right and that angel is also ruling um where money when you want money so when you're doing the pentagram and you're calling you call Raphael before me behind me is Gabrielle the right of me is Michael the left of me is Uriel Uriel is the earth elemental angel who is connected to money 
Raphael, as we spoke before, is for good health. Michael is for fame and fortune plus protection. Um, Camiel, you can contact Camiel um, because that angel is an angel as a fighter. So you could win a court case. You could, you could kill out debt. This is the angel that you want to call when you start feeling like bills is piling up and you want to seek guidance and you want to help. Zadikel is the angel that secures your employment. Cassiel is the angel for property. And Gabrielle is the angel for fertility. Until next time, I'll see you again on the next Sunday. And if you like videos like this, subscribe. And we'll continue to go more about the archangels um, as we go forward.